Oh, there's some shooting happening at the base. Oh, there's a sparrow come to see us. Oh, yeah. Shit, there's uh, a storm fire quite close as well. I couldn't even hear it. Well, luckily, at that very moment, I just... My prepared. car base defenses aren't shooting it, by the way. Don't worry, the, um... No. No. The cuboid is. Uh, okay. Um, well, it, it would be helpful if we, if I, we plug the uh, base defenses in to the system. Six engineers are trying to build a home in Olympus Mons, protected from the assert drones. But they can't help arguing over stuff like this. I feel like building some lights in the base rather than just... Well, I'm, well, doing, I'm building like this so that I can build curtains. walls to put the lights on. There are two lights in the base, Rev. There are more than two lights in the base. There are four lights. There are four lights. <laughs> no, there are more than four lights. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> There's five lights in the entrance. No, there are four lights in the entrance. Oh, no, hold on. There's six lights in the entrance. One, two, Can three, four, five, the, uh, six. The red walk, yeah. And then there's one on the corner here. And so there's like one over every parking walk. space. Well, there's one over two of the parking Challenge spaces where we actually bothered to put them. I mean, okay. Fair. You are physically capable of grinding up the red dwarf. <laughs> yes. You should not grind up the red dwarf. What are you building? The wall. And or walls. <laughs> Are you going to make the Mexicans pay for it? Uh, well, no, I'm going to make you guys pay for it because, like, the components are coming from the base. What is that scraping noise? What scraping noise? I d no, it, it seems to happen when I weld one of these blocks up. Is there some clang in our base? I don't think so, particularly. Can anybody else hear this? No. Uh, no. Hi, Mum. Hi, Mum. Pro streamer there, <laughs> taking phone calls from his mum in the middle of the stream. Yeah, I I, I haven't done anything useful for ages. I've been like, running around, having seeing what I can see. Should we go and beat up some more uh, bad dudes then? Uh, I mean, you could try and pirate one of these cargo ships if you want. Yeah. Bonus well, points if you bring it back in one piece. Well, I and then get shot the moment while well, our base defenses the moment we're back here. Hi, I build another little car just to drive around and see what happens. A small good one. I mean, if you want to build something, you could help with building our base. Like, you could I mean, start could. on the garage for us to park all these cars in. We can't just have more and more cars and know where to park them. Yes, if you do a horizontal mine, I will do a vertical mine, Mr. Heaney. Uh, let's get, let's do some drilling then. What is the name of your ship, Mike? Is it sort of the purple mess or something? I don't think it, it's. I think it is just missile launcher at the moment. Thank you very much. Unfortunately, uh, ooh, I have a problem. Uh, it's only antenna is. It, it's only connecting is beacon two. I haven't actually named the beacon because the beacon got blown up and I've got to rename it. It needs. Um, I thought. I thought we said that mole was a pretty shit name for the uh, the green coloured ship. I I thought we called it the most boring engine. Pache, Elon Musk, Techno King of, um... Techno King, oh yes. I was quite amused that he also has a head of coin or whatever it's called. A master, a master of coin, oh, yes. yes. It just made me think of Yomsborg. I think, I think it's supposed to make people think of Game of Thrones. Okay, but it made... I haven't seen Game of Thrones or Reddit, so it didn't. It, it made me think of ah. Yomsborg. Understandable, but Game of Thrones has a character with the title, or well, several characters because they all die and get replaced, with the title Master of Coin, so I suspect that's what he's trying uh, RCX. to RCX. No. The auto crafting things, could they be moved? Yes, because like, we can't actually get the Zoro in or out. Uh, are you on mute? Do you have a recommended location? Because um, I've kind of put them there absent a better location. Well, either in the refinery area or in the living quarters. Ah. Yeah, they can't go in the refinery location very easily. Um, they could go in the living quarters, but the living quarters do not like currently exist in a firm enough form for that to occur. But you could help build the living quarters. Uh, yes. It's one of the things that is acceptable to build as a box. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> 
Oh, I'm beginning to wish I put a bigger welding nose on this thing. One welder is just not very fast. Okay, how big a room do people want? Huge. I think pretty big, yeah. We've uh, got plenty of space. I, I was asking for numbers, really. Uh, 11 T1. 20 by 20 by 20. 20 by... Okay, Measure I was asking size. for sensible oh. numbers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. You need to be more specific. I am being more specific. I was hoping that you I could think, be more specific. I well, think. I mean, I have no idea how big a, it's reasonable for a room to be. Is you have thing. built Small, a room. Smallish will be fine, I'm sure. I, I, well, I mean, I think it should be de it should be decently big because we have plenty of space. So, not like we're on a ship here, right? We have loads of space. We have like all of Mars. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Great logic. Are you saying that eventually we will have drilled out all of Mars and replaced it with our base? <laughs> a sort of death star. Uh, oh, the slight awkwardness with this is like, if I put the corridor at the front, then you won't be able to see out over where the ships are. But if I put the corridor at the back, then we won't be able to expand the rooms later. I mean, the, cor the corridor could just be the catwalk. You don't need an enclosed corridor. Well, we kind of do, because the whole area is going to be pressurized. Unless oh, you want an airlock area. on every room. I thought that's what you were doing. It makes more sense, I think, to just pressurize the whole thing. Yeah, I like every room. Then put windows along the front of the um, corridor and looking out over the catwalk. Um, I mean, I was going to put windows on the front, but I was just going to have the catwalk on it as its own thing in front of all the rooms. Okay. The sunlight shadow thing is quite intriguing. Uh, I think you'll miss it if you're not like outside. Like a sunlight shadow. I was thinking that too. A very tautologist song, isn't it? I mean, you can, in principle, oh, have yes. a moonlight shadow. <laughs> no, I meant the fact that it uh, contains 4 a.m. in the morning. Fleeting rival. Yeah. Yo, you just lured oh, us all oh, out oh, here crap. to get a shot by the fleeting rival. Oh, well, the fleeting rival is. Oh, no this more. accidental fleeting rival. That's annoying. It, the it gun was... that I was building got blown up before I could finish building it. Oh. <laughs> well, that was a fleeting rival. Indeed. I wondered why I was so disoriented in where, where, when we were looking for my connector. I discovered it's because the panda is parked in the way of all the connectors. RCX, would you mind moving the panda so that I can get to my connector, please? Uh, Actually, I can probably do it. I can probably do it. Let's see. <laughs> He's just saying that to get you if to I, move it faster. No, nah, it's fine. I got drills on the front so I can throw the panda out the way if I have to. <laughs> What's everyone up to then? Oh, God damn it. Uh, I'm I can't laying out see the rooms. Either. I'm trying to build more defenses, but it's quite difficult because I can't actually see where the thing is. Oh, for fuck's sake. And again, they got blown up because they've not finished yet and the thing showed up and shot them. Why are we getting so many drones now? I don't know. Uh, there isn't a certain observer on five books. Oh, well, we should go the out and get the observer then. Something, but... He's saying there's an uh, yeah. observer base five clicks away. I feel like, you know, Skippy. <laughs> What's that, Skippy? <laughs> you think there's an observer base five clicks away? <laughs> uh, also, the Trinity Porter took some shots. What's happened to the Trinity Porter? The Trinity Porter took some shots. Kind of... <laughs> Ridiculous. Is, is Couldn't you just drunk? fix your gain? I, what, like... <sighs> I think the phrase is confiscated some shots. Ah, oh, dear. I think, uh... I think the Trinity Porter must be drunk. Oh, is, this, is yeah. this sort of crescent shape the new gun platform? Uh... Yeah, we, I lost the skirt. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> well, no wonder you got your shots confiscated then. Okay, so I have a uh, six by six bedroom laid out. It's quite sizable. There's enough space for a little shower and some beds. And a toilet. And a toilet. And you can even have your, your own mini bar. So I was thinking we'll have a bar in the communal area. In fact, I might just play in the bar in the communal area now. Well, slightly close to driving up the edge there. I'm guessing there's no real way for me to stop gun platforms getting blown up. Um, build them better. Well, does. Well, I mean... Build well, more does. of them. What do you mean build them better? Like... 
<laughs> they, um, they just get shot. Use decoys. What? What are decoys? They're blocks you can build that uh, will get shot first. Uh, okay. Like Ham. Yeah. No, no. Han didn't get shot first. He shot first. Like we do. Yeah. Is this a communal area then, Dan? It is indeed the communist area. And also that. Uh, I was thinking of some tables in here as well. well. I guess the tables can wait. And then this is a bedroom. This can be your bedroom if you like. You're in it. You can bagsy it. I mean, why why not? I'm actually double bedroom for me and says. Oh yeah. Uh, there is a bit of an issue with painting the bedrooms, which is the 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 bedroom walls on the sides that aren't the windows and don't have doors are party walls. So you have to agree with your next door neighbour what colour the wall is going to be. <laughs> Maybe I should just make the walls double thick to double avoid whip. this problem. Double width, I think. Yeah, yeah that, would, that would make more sense, yes. Because I have this feeling that as soon as Sus discovers that she can paint walls... <laughs> uh, yeah, fine, I'll do that. I don't know. I think we should also do the same to the other... What, the wall on wall. the corridor? I, th I, like, I think it's actually not bad if the, you, the corridor is like a different... Oh shit. If the corridor is whatever colour whoever's on the inside paints it. You yeah, mean? it makes it easier to recognise the rooms. I think it'll add a yeah. touch like, of brightness to room is, this yeah. area. We know whose room is whose, yeah. Also, the communal area will be painted on one side by somebody. Oh yeah, maybe I should double up that one. Yeah. Oh no, that means I have to move the whole thing along by one again. Oh, that's not too hard though, is it? But I guess it makes more sense to do it now than later. Indeed. I haven't got any poison bloody boy oh. can I not get the <laughs> uh, I just fell through the end of the bedroom. Uh might want some more drilling where the uh, in the living area. Since we've gotten for these Ow! Stop shooting me! Such friendly hello. That is Feels not a good. friendly hello. To mess uh, around with uh, uh, I just it's just uh, landed on the hornet there. Yeah, so that's what I that's what I was sobbing about. Was <laughs> uh, that sobbing? Because it sounded like you were kind of crowing. Gypsy, Cambot. Oh, really? that's that's more. Yeah, that's about seven engines they took out. Are there any ablative engines? <laughs> no, there are no ablative <laughs> engines on the, on this vehicle. They're all core engines. Core <laughs> engines. <laughs> <sighs> oh, I see. So this <laughs> that, that, uh, airlock doesn't do anything yet. <laughs> well, it does. It does. It, it 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 prevents air from passing from one side to the other. I, I mean, I can fly over it, so I don't think it does anything. Well, it does. <laughs> air cannot pass from one side of the airlock to the other. Well, indeed. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> just that's just uh, not very useful because it can pass over it instead. Indeed. No, no, nobody said that that wasn't necessary. Quite. Yeah. The, the rest of it, the rest of the wall doesn't do anything. But the, the airlock is fully functional. And anatomically correct. Mm. I suddenly don't feel very safe. For what reason, Dan? There's a panda coming towards me. Oh, yeah, oh yes, those, those famous predators, the pandas, we've covered this. <laughs> I feel as, as uh, dangerous as a piece of eucalyptus. Yeah. You, still wouldn't, you still wouldn't want a panda running at you, but mm. like... It, 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 might, it might not be vegetarian, but I think it's more like a lollop towards you, isn't it? <laughs> like, elephants only eat, um, are vegetarians as well. You still want them frigging running at you. Imagine if Hannibal had had been, like, coming from India instead of coming from Africa. And he had war pandas. And he had war pandas, exactly. Uh, what's exploding? Uh, yeah, sure, just some the stuff. defences again. <laughs> just some stuff. Can I request that my room be placed? more than one warhead radius away from Mike's room. Uh, large <laughs> grid or small grid? <laughs> small grid is fine. Okay. I, I'm not going to be doing warheads in my room. Uh, but I, might. Oh, hold on. I, I, I do have a recording of you saying that now, Mike. Oh. <laughs> How do you do that? would I do a warhead in my room? Uh. Although it is kind of tempting. <laughs> 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 oh dear! Just just fly out of it. What am I drinking? Yeah, drinking. Yes, good idea. Indeed. 
ah, that's what I'm drinking. I just took a big sip of my beer uh, Mike? and found this was a new, and found this was a new yes. beer and still had the cap on. Ah. <laughs> ah. Oh, okay. okay, so um, who was it who, um, Brett, if you were going to, to try and take out the Observer, right? I can join you now. With Which, what vehicle was Rev going to try and take out the Observer? Uh, I believe the Trinity Porter was a weapon of choice. Interesting. I like the way the Trinity Porter is now a weapon rather than a salvage ship vehicle. Indeed. Um, Alright. So... Also, that's kind of a testament to the rest of us, uh, and Rev as well, of course, in that we need almost no salvaging these days. Well, it would get more use if we had a grinder pit, because we could bring in the wrecks of the enemy ships to the grinder pits instead of grinding them out in the fields. Are you saying we should turn ourselves into Mickey's scrap? Yes. Was well, anyone joining me on this assault on the Observer? I believe us. I believe Rev intended to. Did he not? We've not heard from Rev for about five minutes. Yeah. Okay, I'll come and join you. So I yeah. would ask: Is now the correct time to go on an assault mission in a dust storm when we can't see anything? When there's a sparrow coming. Two sparrows. Ah, uh, does that seem to be lined up? Uh, I think so. Do you really want to drive in this weather? Mm, not particularly. Uh, I think we should better wait, we'd better wait until the weather has cleared. That's good. It, is, it, it, is, it does appear to be shooting at the decoy. That's good. I don't think I've ever seen Mike so pleased that his stuff is getting shot. Indeed. <laughs> it, I, was, I had this horrible premonition that Mike would carefully design a thing to be shot and then find that... <laughs> Get shot, yeah. Yeah, it's like the warhead, <laughs> warheads all over again. Indeed. <laughs> Uh, how's the dust storm going out there? Uh, I think it has cleared. So it has cleared, move. yes. Okay, so shall we go? Hold on, I'm getting off. Okay. Oh, what? Can I just park on your car and let you drive me there? Hang on. You could try, but you might get shot by the... Um... Okay, let's go for the one on the low ground first. Because it'll be slightly easier to get to. Well, just slow down for a minute, Mr. Heaney, and I'll just uh, park on your roof. Hold on, let me apply my handbrakes then. Ah. No, please. Okay, lock on then, Rev. The incoming pleating rival. Hold on, now. Rev and I are busy in maneuvers. You need to go a bit forward, Rev. Oh, no, you can. Sorry. I'll go sideways. Okay. In range. Tell me when you're Okay, locked. let's go, let's go. I said, handbrake off. There we go. Yeah, I think it's so well for me. Like you were locked on. You, uh, you carry on. <laughs> <laughs> you carry on. You carry on, Japs. I don't know what you did, Rev, but you destroyed one of my guns. So I, I think I may have destroyed both the guns. I don't. Well, a unknown signal is just like dropped right in my path here, which is kind of entertaining. Oh. Luckily, we're close enough to base that I could just fly home and get the ingredients to repair the gun. Yes, I will. Uh, I got shot. Yes, it would have been nice if Rev hadn't landed on my car and taken the guns off. It was an interesting uh, experiment. Rev, if you want us to build a vehicle to port to the No, no, it, it's fine. I was just... I thought it would be interesting to try. It was interesting to try. Up until the point where I, st I tried to readjust and... Up until uh, the point where you actually tried. Where are you guys at? Getting the replacement parts Trying to get the, the right way up. That Rev yeah. destroyed, but it didn't just... No, I won't have damaged your wheels, will I? I, was, I rolled over the top of you. I don't know what you did. I, I was on the top of you, and then I... I Fell off. We did some pretty epic wheelies, though, with Sorry. you on top of me. So Dan and RCX went off to fight the enemy, and Rev and I did an experiment with latching onto each other. Woof. Woof. Looks like something with a... Uh, maybe an interior just, turret? It looks like a, like a radio tower. Well, it oh. seems to have already been wrecked a bit. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. 
Doesn't sound very assertive. <laughs> oh, well, they're shooting yeah. now. Sparrow. It's a sparrow coming in. Ooh. Sparrow shooting at us, it looks like, maybe. Oh, shut. <laughs> Might have well, shot at something. I'm not sure what. Oh. So, have you guys done all the actual fighting now? Or? Nope. No. We haven't even is got to the actual here, fighting. Is there anyone around here with a welding ship, by the way? Well... I don't want a welding ship, what? I mean, there's a welding ship in the base. Yeah. Are you going to trust Mike sure. to drive it? Hell no. <laughs> why Why do you need to do a, a welding ship, Mike? Because try to weld up a bunch of heavy steel, uh, a bunch of heavy armor manually is quite slow. No, it's fine, isn't it? It's it takes like, you know, I can only do like, oh, fuck. I you can only do oh fuck, myself. yes. I I I oh. into the wall and kill myself. Oh, fuck. What's what's occurring? I may have um I don't know how. There's but I may have overturned the, the cue point. The rescue copter is here. Actually I one hundred percent know how I did this. I turned the speed limit off. Oh. Ah <laughs> yes, well <laughs> you have no one to blame for that but yourself. Uh I can't see the observer base, but I can see a sparrow. There, wow! Well, the the sparrow is just above the observer space. Oh, I can see the do antenna now sticking above it. the ground. Towards uh, and then I will do floor. a left turn when you get it about a few clicks away. Tell me when to stop. Just an up, up now, please. Okay. Doing a turn. Okay, is that get far a shot off. Is that far enough? Uh, getting a shot. Yeah, we've lost one turret. Any... We've lost the missile turret as well. Okay. Uh, we've play. lost the left turret as well. Like, I never even saw the base. I was engaging the sparrow. Okay. I, mean, well, I was thinking that you would shoot at the base. Well, that's nice, but tipping. I was shooting at the sparrow. I'm tipping. <laughs> Well, uh, interesting. Okay, so why have we not got... I'm coming down a little bit now. Things. I'm building a... Um... Oh, shit. Oh, you've put Whoops. welders in. Uh, I've crashed yeah. your vehicle, Mr. Heaney. You have. I think the Borgoy cuboid can successfully be called a write-off. Oh, dear. <laughs> That's okay. It, um... <laughs> we can write it down fast. <laughs> Oh, metal grid. Wow, have you seen this thing? Ah, uh, bollocks, okay. There is oh, well. a, an observer base, like, close, and another one about five clicks out. If that had happened to the... Do you want to get in the chair and uh, join me in going, catching up the panda? Mr. Healy, do you want yeah. to jump well, in the chair? I, 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 don't know be a, I don't know if it'd be much use. Could I get some decoy panda action there, RCX? Okay, come and, come and see, come and see oh, the yeah, fun, though. Come and see the fun. Nah, I'm going, I'm going to go and return okay, to I am in range of it as well. It is. Looks it's like still it's shooting, shooting at me, me, so you should be shooting it. Okay. It's not shooting uh, at me anymore. Okay. I am landing some shots, oh. but not very many. It is shooting at me again. I'm dead. Okay, good work. But I did get some shots off on the turrets. Uh, like oh, is that the observer base over there? Okay, I've destroyed that something on it. I've destroyed it. I've destroyed something. Looks it's like no longer shooting at me. me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've taken everything out. Okay. There's a barrow still, I believe. I'm not sure what it's doing, because it's mostly... Yeah, the sparrow yeah. might have been defanged. Uh, you can probably take your turrets off of shooting at the... Um... Okay, turrets off. Happy? Probably, roughly. In. Uh, I will take out the. Uh, okay, cool. Ah, oh, I'm getting massively lagged uh, in this oh, There is a Reaver interloper which is oh, uh, engaging the panda. This is not good. Okay, okay, I'm back okay. on my ship. Yeah, the panda is uh, yeah. not going to survive there. I'm going to fly. Oh. Slow. Uh, is that you, Rev? I'm shooting something, but I've got my turrets on so I can run away from the Reaver. Okay, well, you were nearly shooting me. 
I'm running away from the weaver at top speed, but it's not chasing, so we're okay. Yes. It's firing up in the air, but I don't see what it's firing at. I feel not entirely safe here. Come onto my ship, man. Oh, it's shooting at something over oh, there. Oh, it's shooting at one of the drones. Yeah, I just uh, just realised that I'm an idiot. Oh wow! Really? I, I like Only the now. <laughs> I, I built a We've big. That for at least five, yeah. I, I built a big thing with a welder in it, and then not you not turned the welder on whilst I was building it. So ah, yeah. it <laughs> Admittedly, that wouldn't have saved me having to fly the, here and back all the time to pick stuff up, but still. Oh yes, uh, the Borgoid cuboid is not looking entirely happy here. It looks really impressive like that, actually. Are you suggesting we leave it there as an art installation? No. Mm. This whole uh, desert skateboard is going to turn into Burning Mike uh, Fleeting rival. It's making a beeline for the base. It's now shooting yeah, into the base. Him. It's taking one of the uh, defense installations. The leftmost really? one, as you're looking at the base, doesn't seem to be working. The yeah, defensive um, art installations. Like, I've been busy building my decoy, so I haven't had time to fix the defenses. <laughs> okay. That's brilliant. The because decoys are getting... only useful, like, <laughs> in combination <laughs> with guns. The defenses keep getting shot, is the problem. That's a okay. bit of an angle there, Mike. What is? The mm. thing you've just built, the thing you're standing on now, is quite yeah. jaunty. Yeah. What do you mean? Like, it's fine? I do like the uh, look of the, of the uh, Borgoid cuboid from here, actually. <laughs> um, stand at the opening to the base and just look out into the desert. I think it that makes us... actually look pretty cool. I think it makes us more scary, you know, like in adventure films where they come across, like, they know this is cannibal country because there's, like, skulls on sticks just feel, everywhere. I've, this no, is, like, I, the I mech equivalent. Like the Statue of Liberty in Planet of the Apes. What, you fools, oh, you blew up the Borgoid cuboid. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Having the battery exposed on the top is perhaps not the best design idea. Who, to whom are you speaking? Mike. I, I'm on uh, one of these um, art installations. Yeah, um, perhaps, I mean... That's one base down, but there are more out there. It's been lovely to have you today, so join us again next time as we launch a new kind of aerial assault and also argue over who gets which bedroom. <laughs> <laughs>